Welcome to another episode of Cars Unlocked. Today we're checking out the 2022 Nissan Qashqai SV. A little history on our Qashqai here. 2019, they did a nice redesign here in Canada. And for 2022, it's relatively unchanged from the previous models. And with an MSRP of about 27,298, there is a lot to love. This is a perfect little commuter vehicle for your family. So before we get into this, I'm just gonna wait for you guys to subscribe. Hopefully you subscribe, very easy. Hit that like button if you guys like what you see from Cars Unlocked here and you learned something about the Qashqai today. But checking out the front end here, relatively unchanged, like I said, but we do have this flattened out Nissan symbol here. It's gonna come with features like our intelligent cruise control. You have this nice V-Motion grill here that swoops down in chrome that Nissan's known for. We have our LED daytime running lights and you get the full Nissan safety suite. So you get automatic high beam assistant, automatic headlights, and your forward emergency braking. So it will help stop a lot sooner if you're in a Ford emergency and it will notify you if you're approaching a car in front of you too fast. Let's start it up and check out the inside and how this thing drives. You get the push button start so you can use your remote starter or the push button starter. You're sitting in an eight-way manual adjustable driver's seat. The seat is heated. Nissan's really known for the comfortable seats so very comfortable seating. You have this nice D-shaped leather wrapped wheel. That's something you get when you go up to this SV package and the wheel is heated. We have features like Pro Pilot Assist right on our wheel, so that's kind of the semi-autonomous driving. It will help keep you centered in your lane and use the intelligent cruise control to keep you a safe distance from the vehicle in front of you. Coming up the side profile, this one comes with our gunmetal metallic finish, LED turning accents, chrome windows here. You have the Nissan intelligent key and remote entry on the vehicle. This SV package, you also get the remote starter, so you can start it up from a distance. This one's sitting on these 17 inch aluminum alloy rims. 147 pounds feet of torque and 141 horsepower coming out of this two liter four cylinder engine. And I've always been impressed with the power plan of the Qashqai. I don't really have too many bad things to say about how it drives. Certainly um, good on fuel, you get eight liters combined or 35 miles per gallon combined. This one comes all wheel drive. You have an economy mode, you have a sport mode if you want to go a little faster. And then you obviously you just have the regular normal mode. The advantage of something like this is it really kind of zips in and out to spots here. You can take turns pretty quick. You do get that sportier style crossover feel. Um, and then you get the safety and the reliability of the all wheel drive. Here's a quick shot of the back here. It's gonna come with a backup camera for parking, rear cross traffic alert. You have these parking sensors as well, and you'll have your rear emergency braking like I mentioned in the front. But let's look at the cargo area. It does have quite a bit of cargo capacity here. You have the nice tunnel cover, carpeted mats come with it. This is my really only complaint. You don't have kind of a flat cargo area when you fold the seats down. You can see there's that little hump. Nissan sells the floor separately that you can get to add on there, but there's still that little hump. But when you fold the seats down, 60-40 split, tons of space, couple dead bodies, you do the Ikea thing, hockey sticks, whatever you're about, there's lots of space in there seven inch touchscreen display here and it's going to do things like apple carplay android auto there we go that's the cirrus satellite radio you can also play music through bluetooth this sv model is going to come with six regular speakers but it does sound great and then you have um, digital temperature control you still get a cd player in this thing which is a little surprising um, but digital temperature control you can adjust the climate for both sides and then you have things like uh, electric parking brake with the auto hold. Let's see how it feels back here in the back of the Qashqai. Not too bad. This is the difference between going up to something like the Nissan Rogue. You don't have as much space back here, but still quite a bit of space for me. You get things like cup holders back here. I'd like to see some USBs, so maybe in next year's model, we can get some USBs back here. So take a look at the sunroof here in the Qashqai. It's just a regular sunroof here. Nothing too big like in the other vehicles. So the backup camera comes on automatically when you put it in reverse, and it's gonna come with sensors as well, which you can see as I approach the car, and you know to stop. Overall thoughts after driving this thing multiple times, this is a phenomenal drive. I uh, can't say nothing really bad about the Qashqai. I mentioned my few beasts with the trunk and things like that, but in terms of driving, 
it drives very, very well. It does have a CVT transmission. I know you guys are gonna comment on the CVT, but the Qashqai has been a staple of Nissan all over the world and is now like very popular in Canada. So certainly, like I said, if you're a single guy looking for a crossover, family of three, family of four, small growing family, Qashqai will definitely fit the bill and it should definitely be on your guys' shopping list. Now, if you guys are in the Ontario area, don't hesitate to contact me at my work. It's called St. Catharines Nissan. I'm gonna put the links in the description below if you guys wanna inquire about purchasing any Nissan vehicles that you've seen on my channel. And don't forget guys, if you're new, just subscribe. That's all you gotta do. Really easy to support the creators. Just subscribe, hit that like button, maybe share this with someone looking for a cash guy, and we'll see you in the next video. Thank you for watching. Woo!